today. I've got loads of uni work to do, so I thought I would just bring you along on a little like study and work with me day. But yeah, I'm gonna get ready in a second. I also need to drop my washing off. Um, luckily where I live, there's a laundry place like next door, um, super cheap. It's, uh, I think it's like 7K per kilo. Um, and just for an exchange rate, 17K is a pound. So per kilo, it's like 30p? No, 40p? I can't do math. I always sleep with my curtains open because I like waking up to natural daylight instead of setting an alarm. How cute is my view? Okay, so I'm finally ready. So I'm gonna head to one of my fave cafes when I need to get some work done. Um, it's really easy to focus there and also it's right by the supermarket. So I'm going to go there and get some stuff for dinner later to stop ordering food in instead. <laughs> done so that's good but I did get loads of other work done so I, it was still really productive um, I also went to the shop and bought toothpaste which I did need but I didn't buy any dinner because the noodle things that uh, I wanted to get for dinner and just like instant noodles because I don't like to cook um they all had chicken they didn't have any vegetarian ones yeah also didn't get any dinner which means i'm gonna end up ordering something later tonight for dinner probably either stead poke bowl or sushi because vegetarian sushi because that's what i seem to be living off of these days also can we just take a moment to appreciate my nails. They look so cute. Um, I got them done on Saturday. I got pedicure as well, but we don't show our feet for free on the internet. Um, uh, I always go to this salon in Barawa. It's called Colours. They are so good there. Like I've had my nails done elsewhere. I went to Think Pink in Seminyak, which is like quite a popular place to go, but they literally lifted after like a few days. Um, these ones, uh, colours, it's just a gel manicure. And the last time I had them done, I had them redone on Saturday, but they lasted me a month, which like is normally unheard of. My nails are in such good condition at the moment. Like they're so long. Um, this was like trimmed as well. So they were even longer than this cute my cute little moon tattoo i've got a moon on this hand and i've got a sun on this hand um got them done by maddie here in bali i've shared him i think on my tiktok before um but yeah he's like the best he also did my big tattoo um he also did this one yeah and i also have an infinity on my finger for my mum but I did get that one done in Bali but that was in like 2017 um and I just went to the little tattoo place like next to Revolver in Changi um I mean I wouldn't recommend there personally they're fine like it's I mean it's a finger tattoo so it's gonna fade they actually did also do this one um but I mean, it's a tattoo place that also sells slices of pizza. So 
yeah, <laughs> do with that information what you will. Okay, it's nearly 9 p.m. So I'm halfway through work and I have ordered some dinner. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Okay, so I got sushi, obviously. I got some um, cucumber rolls and then this one is a crispy eggplant one or aubergine, they call it eggplant here. And then I got a little bag of soy sauce. So I got 16 pieces of sushi and including delivery, it cost me £2.65. Literally is such a bargain here. Um, but yeah, work's going okay. I've got loads done so far, which is good. And yeah, my first five till one shift is going pretty good. Got my washing back. Literally. Oh, it smells so good. I don't know what fabric softener they use here in Indonesia, but it always smells so good. It's the same in Thailand as well. My washing always smelled so good there. But yeah, I'm gonna, uh, God, just woken up. Um, I'm gonna sort out my washing, shower, and then head to a new cafe, which I've not been before. So I will maybe take you with me. Um, today I'm gonna try and get the work that I didn't do yesterday done. So I need to actually do uni work today, not anything else to be confirmed. Apologies for the abrupt end. I did not record anything else with me speaking, but as you can see, I did get some uni work done and I also made it to the supermarket to get my dinner. So yeah, I actually had a productive day and then I just headed home and did some work in the evening basically. Subscribe if you want to see more of what I get up to on my travels and thanks for watching everyone.